Hello friends, this is Umesh and today we will create this model in NX. So if you will see here, I have one top view and one front view and one section view is from CC. So this is a CC view so that we can see this portion, say this D is a detail view and we need this kind of shape on inside wall and one more section is here this is BB which is cutting from here and uh, let us start this with the front view so select a sketch and YG is my working plane and starting from this a little bit up and taper right and now select offset or first I am assigning this dimension zoom and inner is 26 so from this to this though this is the okay I am creating this inner one so half of 26 is 13 and uh, again see this one okay this is a basic section so I'm using again profile okay and close now select it from this to this the gap is given as 31 divided by 2 and uh, total gap is given as 27 and select this point and this horizontal axis make them coincidence and now 26 is this so outer one is 26 select this and this point this is 27 so half of 27 this gap is coming okay and delete this constraint okay and inner circle is given as 22 so 11 and this is 14 so click and select this this gap is 14 and select this point and this point make them horizontally align right so it is fully constrained now draw a rectangle and now the dimension of this rectangle this 35 is a diameter so from this to this is 35 divided by 2 right this is given and the thickness is 3 so double click and change it to 3 so this is the first sketch what I need now finish and use this revolve and this is first and second now vector is this one and click OK right so this is the first step now come to this plane again select okay and go to view and add it section right so that I can see the inner shape and here I need this kind of shape and come to home and from here I'm using this project curve and project this single curve okay right use the stream and remove it and close so see one triangle again one more and again one more okay draw this shape again
now dimension it or oh, first remove it now dimension from top to this point this gap is given as 2.5 okay and uh, C 1.5 is this gap is 1.5 and uh, here it is given okay and uh, okay this 2.5 it is not given so I'm starting with this this and this line this gap is given this 4.5 minus 1.5 3 this is 3 and again select this line and click here this gap is Okay, first delete it and select this line and drag it and it is not dragging it means something is wrong with this line okay now trim this now select this line and it is 1.5 okay 1.5 and the angle is given as 14 so 14 with this and this it is 14 degree now the sketch is fully defined again one more same triangle I need so come to this draw a line and here now use the trim remove this click and uh, come to this equal this line and this line make them equal and again this and this make this equal and still some distance is remain and the distance is 1 so double click here and to 1.2 close okay and see one triangle dash fill another triangle dash one more triangle so delete this and again I'm using the same thing make them equal make this and this equal okay now this 2.5 is given uh, from the top of this point to this second top point right now click uh, this is 2.5 and all three are properly placed uh, if you want you can cut it otherwise no problem I will use reason bounded curve then we will assign this revolve so revolve and this face this face and this and the axis is still the same and unite and okay right you can see you can see from here okay now my next step is to cut this shape and for this shape I'm selecting the same plane again okay and the circle is 3 radius so click here and here 3 is a radius 6 the diameter and pick this point and this point make them vertically align and the gap is given as 7 close and uh, 6 degree taper angle is there so click and drag here and again I am using this mirror so the angle will come automatically equal for both and from here use this angular between this and this click angle is 6.0 right close make this close and I'm going to assign some dimension for this so that it will fully define like it is 30 and go to trim and remove this inner portion okay now finish and uh, extrude see here we have four cut one 
one two three four so select this completely complete curve and uh, it's changed to analyzed no it is not mm. okay select this value and uh, I'm selecting this symmetric value uh, apply this gap and remove subtract and okay right zoom it and uh, select this portion and I'm using circular pattern so go to the circular feature is selected my axis is this one and the number of count as two and click OK it is failed to update why let's see the feature is OK and vector is also OK and the number of count double click over it and here I'm changing it to count and pitch it's two count and the angle is 90 and click OK right see okay next is this portion is left so this portion is only on two side see here and one opposite side so click and select uh, this not this one this plane and click here orient the view okay and zoom and draw a rectangle click here right and now dimension it and the dimension is 4 and 7.2 from this bottom click from here to this point uh, 7.2 and close and pick this point and this vertical axis coincidence and for this one okay just enter the value it is 5.5 no problem because it will merge with this phase so finish hide this one hide this hide this right now I have this portion only so come to extrude and from here um, first select this and uh, until extended up to this I want so this is here and from this until extended and my second phase is this one no it is not coming with this so value and come inside oops it is not click this and this is the face now it is okay yes it is okay but the second side see it is not moving make this unite and this face I'm changing to this outer one okay drag it reverse this no it is not coming properly and from here until selected is this or reverse the direction Mm -hmm. cancel it again select this extrude and wireframe select this and this is zero so zero is this one so until extended select the surface right and for end I'm again selecting this and this time it is outside and make the boolean has unite and okay see it will combine right Okay, opposite side is not visible anywhere if you want to do you can do the same thing on the opposite side also so click it and select this but here and uh, come to this 
extended this is the face and the second face is this outer one and unite okay so this is the model if you want to check any oops where is the teeth it is here show it right hide this one so hope you understand this how to create this part thank you for watching have a nice day